Hello everyone, this is Akuchi, back with some more Dominion. I'm going to be playing my third match of the season. This one against the Swordfish Trombone. And, uh, yeah, we're down two games. We started out with 2-4, two, 2-4, four, two, four, so uh, we really need to start turning things around and getting some wins on the board. So hopefully we can do that here. Gonna play with some like lists. I think I just have plunder cards in my like lists. I think I updated it, hopefully. As for Swordfish Trombone, I think we may have played last season. Nope. I feel like we played recently. Don't know when. Maybe some tournament. And away we go. We've got Stockpile, Margrave, Lookout and Sanctuary for Thinning. We got Voyage as well. Um, hmm. Way of the Turtle. That has some interesting options with Voyage. I mean, it's, usually it's a good idea to play to play with Voyage. Forge is pretty good with Voyage. So we can do a bunch of stuff here in the opening. I do want to get a Margrave, which implies Stockpile. I mean, Lookout and Enchantress are definitely good cards, but I think we want to get Stockpile Old Map, I'm thinking. I don't really need Lookout. You can thin with Sanctuary and Forge, probably. Uh, we could buy a Forge here. So if I'm not going to buy a Voyage, oh, what about next turn? Next turn I'm going to have three. So yeah, we don't want to rotate. There's literally nothing at the moment that costs four. Which is... So we'll buy a Stockpile next turn. Um, so we could get... Margrave. But I think I want Forge. It's a little better than usual with Way of the Turtle. It's interesting, though. There's nothing good to, like, turn one estate into. At the moment, there's literally nothing to turn two estates into. Uh, okay, sure. I'm 
Okay, so next turn we're going to have Forge and probably two estates. So that's pretty nice. Oh, hey. There's no plus actions. So Forge is definitely less good than usual. But we already have the Forge, so that's that. Um, I think we just get a Margrave. It is what it is. We'll get a Voyage here. So our opponent doesn't have a voyage. That's fine by me. Sunken treasure is okay. Because you can gain sanctuary. I like sanctuary. Ooh. Ah! Whatever. Let's just forge next turn. So I definitely want to buy a stockpile. I guess we could forge a stockpile. That works just as well. No, it doesn't work just as well. Hmm. I don't really see anything... to do about this. So we're pretty much done with Forge now. Probably. For now. What the heck was all that about? I just bought a billion stockpiles, okay. That's fine, I guess. I don't mind a distant shore. But I probably need a gold like this turn. Hmm. I don't really want my opponent to have a voyage, do I? I, mean, I don't know how good it is. Hmm. I don't have any sanctuaries. I really want that. No, I'll leave it here. It's cool. I'll leave it there. 
And we have a voyage turn. We might as well do the Margrave thing. That's what I figure. And we can play old map. I don't think I want to. So we, we totally need plus buy. So. But we can get it next turn. All right. So we can get a gold here. And then we can get one more gold. And then we can get a sanctuary, because we have the stockpile. Let me get a sanctuary the following turn. This looks pretty good to me. Hmm. Void seems really valuable. It's really going for the distant shores. I'm not going to rotate if our opponent doesn't rotate. I think it's worth playing the Margrave here. We have nine, which isn't great. Clearly we want a sanctuary and something. And then nothing that costs four. Enchantress doesn't I mean we've got enough terminals to play. Oh, that was dumb. I just did that non-thinkingly. Let's just buy a distant shore. Okay. I think I don't want to exile the forge. Eh. I don't know, maybe I should. Nah. So should we get a silver? We can potentially like forge.
I'll do it. Okay, that looks pretty good. Definitely want more sanctuaries now. Your opponent should definitely get a sanctuary. That much is clear. Opponents used up all their stockpiles. Okay. Yikes. Well, we got attack. Oof. That's really bad. That's a... Uh, that's a... Uh, we're not buying anything this turn. Oof. All our treasures are at the bottom there. The attack is really painful. It should be noted. Our opponent keeps getting voyages. That's not really a problem. Wow! This is brutal. I've really lost control. It's probably okay. But, you know, maybe it isn't. Our opponent's flooding themselves with estates, and they don't have a forge, and they only have one sanctuary. They probably get to... Oh, interesting. Um, probably going to get attacked, but that's fine. Yeah, okay. I forgot Ma Maelstrom can attack. That is interesting. Voyage is pretty valuable. Okay. If we need to trash, we trash old map, I think. Okay, so we can forge gold the state into province. And we don't really get to do anything else. Hmm. <sighs> We could also forge province into province. It doesn't feel quite as good.
This is a really nice hand. Thankfully, we're not going to be Maelstrom attacked. Oh, maybe we are. Okay. Um, probably Sanctuary. All right. Uh, hmm. Yeah, let's just forge province into province by sanctuary. Seems pretty good to me. Double Voyage. Our opponent does have a Forge now. But now they're trailing us a lot of EP. I don't think they can win. Oh, lots of stuff being turtled. I wonder why way the forge was turtled there. Hmm. I mean, that's it. You've already played your three cards. We have some good cards down there. Cards we want to see next turn. I'm thinking about... We should probably just turtle. Copper! I didn't even know our opponent had a copper left in the deck. I don't have two coppers left. It's so weird. 
I guess I haven't trashed much. Cool. Um, yeah, let's play it. And that's a wrap. Uh, whoops, uh, okay. That's one. I think we play it, started that one first. Hour of an early voyage. I'm glad we didn't like even weren't even tempted to get a second voyage because our opponent swapped off it. Playing with multiple voyages makes my head hurt. We got Margrave again. I guess our opponent has black market on their like list. I'm not a fan of that. That's fairgrounds on their like list. What? Weird. Oh my goodness. They are just playing with fire. They have Black Market and Museum on their like light list. Oh my goodness. That's insane. Alright, so what are we doing? I don't even know. We could do the same thing as our opponent. Open a Margrave. What's tireless mean? Oh, hey, that's pretty good. Yeah, I can get behind that. Terminal draw is good. We don't have trashing, so we're going to want to try to find that from the black market. We have villages, but... You know, we could always do it some more. So this is bad, but expected. Our opponent got the same thing. We could have borrowed for something, of course. Of course. Yeah, let's let's borrow for bizarre. What else are we gonna do? Oh, this is so funny. By playing Margrave. We set up, like, the Margrave of our opponent. That's really funny. <laughs> and it's like, why not borrow, you know? Probably, like, one more bizarre then we can get Black Market. Or maybe even like Marquee. That's pretty good too. Wow. That's some real bad stuff. We do at least probably have a bazaar there. Mm, okay. Yeah, let's get a black market, I guess. Trashing, trashing would be great.
I feel like we don't need a second Margrave. There's... <laughs> I decrease my odds of seeing my village if I borrow here, which is the reason why I'm strongly considering not borrowing. Yeah, okay. I really want the marquee, though. Okay. Really want the marquee. Oh, double tireless Margrave. I don't know if that's actually good. I guess it's fine once you have merchant camp. Although then your hand gets pretty full. Yeah, I don't, I don't actually like the second Margrave. Yeah, Marquis, where it's at. For sure. I think our opponent hasn't played a black market yet. At least I haven't noticed it. Okay, well, Apprentice Trashes, so that's probably good enough for me. Bishop also trashes, but... I'm fine to borrow. We don't really have, like, stuff in there we care about. It's probably good to have a Merchant Camp, just... Just to make it clear. So this is bad. We got a bazaar down there, but such is life. Mm hmm. Royal Galley is good, but it's not trashing. What do we do with this money? We could get an envoy. I don't really want a second black market, I don't think. Not yet. Silver doesn't excite. Envoy is okay, but I'd just rather have marquees. Um, I don't really want a second merchant camp. It's not too bad. I only need a top deck one. It's definitely not good, though. Eh, maybe we need the plus actions. I'll deal. Hmm, that's annoying. This one, I think. We have a black market, but nothing else, really. We do trigger a shuffle. Crucible? Yeah, that's pretty good.
How does encampment work? Yeah, I think encampment's is bad. You gotta get trashing, right? This is gonna be a long game. These Margraves are just unrelenting. Tireless, you might even say. Gotta be crystal. Okay. Hmm. I think I prefer bizarre over conspirator. And I definitely prefer Borrow Marquee over Patrol. So I think that's a don't buy. Charm, it's okay, theoretically. But, eh. Honestly, at this point, I think I want to borrow for Marquee. Oh, right, right, right. Royal Galley. We do have an apprentice down there. I hope we can pair it with a state. Oh, no. Well, hopefully we find another village. That's the good marquee. That's what I want. Mm-hmm. That's a very good turn. Marquis Bazaar. Really? Okay. Ooh, unfortunately I can't buy that siren. So probably we're not buying any of these. Uh, this is this is not good. Yeah, I don't want you to do much in the way I gain and play, but maybe it doesn't matter. Oh, you've got two black markets. That's right. Swamp Hags, pretty annoying. Pretty annoying. Oh, that's both our merchant camps. That's actually a dangerous move we just made there. I think I probably lost this game. I wonder what the turning point was.
I'm not sure what the turning point was. Hmm. Yeah, we're kind of screwed here. We could skip a turn. I got two marquee here. Like, what are we even doing? We need to play black market. There's just not, nothing else we can do. And we're not going to get to play black market, apparently. Um, I know this is very good. I mean, Swamp Shacks is obviously fine. I don't know. I don't know if it's any good. I feel like I have to keep playing, because I might find Outpost. You know? Crucible is just, like, better than Apprentice, for the most part. On this kingdom. Is so good. Really? Council room? I guess you can play it before your second Margrave, but that's not always going to work out that way because, you know, tireless. I don't know. It's a little greedy, but my opponent's still very hard, very far ahead. Yeah. I don't think I can come back. If you take provinces, I'm pretty screwed. It's all looking grim.
Junk dealer, yes please. Could go like secluded shrine. But junk dealer just seems more reliable. Uh, I wish I could have. Yeah. Mistakes were made. Oh, we have another marquee. It doesn't actually matter. All right. Could just get double festival, that seems pretty good to me. Could get gold festival, but whatever. Oh. Could get... Hmm. Yeah, let's... Oh, no, 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 no. Uh... Uh, screw it. Let's, let's do that. Of course our opponent top decked council room, why wouldn't they? Maroon, that doesn't even seem all that good. Cardinals, mildly annoying. But not super annoying. Probably needed to get another black market, right? Probably. Our opponent just trashed province. Um. Okay. I feel good about that. Uh, we just have to hope we find more plus action. If we don't, whatever, we lose. It's all fine. Real. Gal Galley the Margrave, okay. Seems fine. Those are some really good cards, but I don't mind them being discarded since I actually need a village more than anything else.
Discard four. Easily done. I guess we do black market stuff here. I don't think we want any of those. Oh, hey, if our opponent plays council room, we get to draw an extra card. Huzzah. We're still in a dangerous spot. I mean, we've been pretty lucky to not get a dud so far. We've been playing it quite aggressively. And our opponent's got the better reliability tools. So on the other hand, if our opponent can get four provinces this turn, they might be able to. That'd be nice. If they get three, I mean, they've pretty much won. Does it even make sense to play out? Why are you trashing provinces? You could trash, like, literally anything else. Oh, I guess it makes sense, right? You're trying to... Trying to end the game. Then you just... Yeah, you got there. Okay. Alright, well, first black market pull was good for me, but then it seems my opponent got the better, the better goods. Yeah, I didn't realize my opponent had messaged me about encampment rules. That's probably why that was taking so long.
Okay, tournament. Good news is we have champion to deal with followers. There is some landing party cavalry potential, potential fun stuff, but honestly, I think this is going to come down to what is the what is the draw. I guess and cavalry is draw. Cavalry is draw. So I think I'll open page cavalry. There's some, like, gamble potential here. There's definitely some gamble potential. There's also Sentinel, of course. Wow. Hmm. Yeah, wow. Yeah, what's, what's more important? Hmm. Trashing seems pretty important. Yeah, I think I like Sentinel into Gamble Page, is my thinking. That way we guarantee a Sentinel. Alright, my opponent's gonna take uh, what they estimate to be a 5 minute break, so I'm gonna pause the recording, and I'll be back when we resume. And we are back. So we got a good situation here. Oh. Hmm. Never mind. I thought we were going to be able to find. Yeah, we had a five out of seven chance of being able to find our overgrown estate. That would have been great. As is, this is not great. We can top deck a page if we really want to, like, accelerate. You know, the cost of that is we don't buy anything. This does seem like a situation where I want to buy... multiple pages, so I think I'll actually just do that. Yeah, if we had seen the Overgrown Estate with our Sentry, we'd been able to draw and play Page. Well, you know, if we saw that as well. And if we didn't, we'd... Yeah. I mean, there was a, you know, what our opponent did there, basically. Our opponent got the nuts, right? No, 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 they gambled to play Page. Okay, so they didn't get to trash any of their, their stuff. So that's kind of unlucky for them. I'm thinking about cavalry here. Hmm. I mean, tournament's also good. But no, let's let's get cavalry. Okay, that seems fine. <laughs> Should we trash the Necropolis? Hmm. I don't think we should trash the Necropolis. Should we trash the Cavalry? Hmm. These are questions I don't know the answer to.
I mean, maybe the cavalry buy wasn't wasn't good. Unclear. It did let me shuffle faster. Should we gamble? I think so. I'm pretty content, I think, with two pages going up the line for now. A third wouldn't hurt, but I don't think the time is quite right for that. We're going to need plus buy at some point. But not yet. Alright, whatever. It is what it is. Will our Sentinel ever find Overground Estate? I don't know. Worked for our opponent. Oh, that's interesting. The Overgrown Estate happens before the top decking from Sentinel, so. The dream, the turn, what was it, three dream of, like, Sentinel. Oh, this is interesting. Treasure Hunter is gaining a bunch of cards. I don't know why. Hmm. So our opponent has a treasure hunter. Do I want four silvers? Oh, because we played cavalry, right. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. I don't think I want that many silvers. And I probably don't want to gamble for that. Like, we're guaranteed to have Necropolis with that warrior. That seems really good to me. All right. Seems good to me. Hey, I wanted that silver. I'll find another. I said I was thinking that's a good sentinel pull, but then I'm like, eh, I'm not sure. Maybe Hubble? Maybe not. Trashing Necropolis, okay. No, don't you... Ugh. Whatever. If I need to get 17 silvers, I'll get 17 silvers. I trashed a warrior. That's really good. Apparently, our opponent has a hero. That's interesting. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. 
if I should get this treasure hunter. I don't think so. I'm, I'm good with the page. I'm never going to trash this overgrown estate. I can feel it. I'm going to have to remodel it. I mean, we gotta get, we gotta get our immunity, right? I don't want to gamble, because we have horses down there. That's no good. Let's get a sentry, I'm thinking. Sentry looks pretty good to me. Oh, huh. <laughs> That's fun. Our opponent got a lurker to get their warrior back. That is fun. Look at this. Incredible. Hmm. Incredible. So it's looking like followers aren't going to be very good. But obviously, princesses and trusty steed are great. Probably princess is the best. But we definitely need some draw. Dang, that's not very good. Now we're going to stick with the warrior for now. I just cannot trash this overgrown estate. Can't do it. Gonna have to remodel it. What else can we do? Okay. Um, yeah, let's sentry here. I don't really need these cards. I like the Sentinel, though. Oh, we could, like, 
by cavalry is to try to keep it going. Uh, this could be the time. Try to think about what's down there. Gotta be princess, I think. I mean, we could do followers for just this turn. Don't think that's worth it. I think princess for this turn. We could go again with Cavalry. I wish I knew what that last card was. I don't think I care enough. So I'll probably get, like, Remodel. And, uh... Hmm, we could get a Storeroom. That's pretty good. Hopefully there's a cavalry left. We want the treasure hunter. What did our opponent gain? Gains two horses. <laughs> That's a lot of silvers. That's nice. Oh, we triggered a shuffle there. Interesting. So we just want to gamble three times. There's too many. Why do I have this treasure hunter I'm never going to play? Mistakes were made. Um... Hmm. 
Probably storeroom. Oh, I can't even... Yeah, I cannot buy that treasure hunter. Can't do it. Uh, yeah, that was bad to trigger that shuffle, probably. With, like, the sentinel. No, we can't... We can't get rid of that warrior. We just don't have draw. Our opponent's got a lot of horses, right? Ugh. No. Stop. We have more cavalries total, though. We just keep on getting rid of them because we're trying to find better stuff to do. It doesn't always work out. Oh my goodness. So our opponent fully drew their deck. So they get the trusty steed. No, they don't have a province yet. No, we have five and five in terms of cavalries. Our opponent's got another hero, too. Dang. Yeah, we're in trouble. Oh boy. We are in big trouble. Hmm. Our opponent for sure doesn't have a province in hand, we know that much. Not sure that I need that sentinel. I mean, I'm going to be getting a treasure hunter, probably. Like, should I trash that silver? I'm halfway tempted to do it. I'm going to do it. Thank goodness. So diadem's really good. <laughs> um, we don't have a ton of buys, but I have a fair number. I don't know what's down there. Don't we want to... Man. This is a tough one. I 
think I just want to gamble to find all my cavalries. That's what I think. Uh, can I win? So we have 11 actions. No, we definitely can't win. I should put the landing party in there. That's my bad. Our opponent can't win. Oh, our opponent does have a remodel now. Are they going to be able to get a remodel? Uh, we could have done some better stuff here. So I think we're going to want to go with probably gold. Probably landing party, storeroom, and something. I don't know what the something is. Hmm. Remodel is pretty flexible. All right, so I don't think our opponent can get four provinces. We're definitely in a pretty tough spot if they take three, but we might be able to win.
Our opponent was like stockpiling horses up until that moment, I feel like. Their previous turn was just like full of horses. And they used up some horses, so I don't even think they're going to get a great a great turn here. So Trusty Steed is obviously really good. Bag of Gold is okay. Yeah, so it's pretty tough for me to beat the gold situation. But that's okay. Looks like I didn't need to worry. Anyway. They just don't have the bias. We're gonna we're gonna win here, right? Seems likely. We're gonna get like a billion silvers. That's gotta count for something. Interesting. They have ten horses in there, and they have nine other cards. All right, I feel like we can win this one. Pretty easy. All right. We can, like, remodel. All that stuff. Uh, we have another province, I think. I'm not 100% on that. I think our opponent has two provinces. So we can remodel two provinces. Then we need to buy two provinces. I mean, certainly we don't need the cavalries, right? I don't even think I want to play the tournament. I think we have this. All right. It's all good.
Well, that was a weird game. That was a weird one. Yeah, it was safe for me to take the province the previous turn. Just didn't realize how kind of how many horses our opponent ended up expending on that turn. That was well above what the, they can normally do. All right, what do we have here? Mm, we seem to be missing some draw. We got broker. We got broker draw. Which is peculiar. Uh, broker or fortress? That's that's not difficult at all. Uh, no, I will not be. Wow, what a what a weird. Wow, we can ball. That's great. Okay, ball for broker and transmogrify maybe. Hmm. Wow, this is crazy. Then we can desert guides. Yeah, sure. I mean, Transmogrify looks great with Fortress, so... Sure, let's do this stuff. This is weird. Let's do favors, just so we can... Desert Guides again. It's definitely not, you know, not bad, but... I'll keep it, because we can call Transmogrify to gain what? A scheme? Okay. That's not good. Uh, do we want a bobble? Bobble's pretty good. Probably worth trashing to get a bobble. On the other hand, we could just prepare the broker. Is Bobble the only plus buy? Now we have Market Square. Do we have enough? One, two, three, four, five, six. We technically do have enough. So if we don't trash here, Oh yeah, but we don't have that Transmogrify in play. And we can't get it into play. Yeah, so I don't think we prepare just yet. I like Bobble. Yeah, sure, we'll scheme. I like scheming the broker. We could scheme the Transmogrify. I do like a market square. Where are we ultimately going here? Ball is good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. We definitely could Desert Guides here. 
but I think I want to do that. And now let's see if we can we can make it all work. Uh, two, three, four, five. We just need one unique card. All right, let's go for it. All right, what do we do here? Probably coin favor. Bias certainly don't matter. Oh, we can top deck, right? Now we can also ball. And broker. Well, that seems nice. I mean, we definitely feel pretty ahead. We shouldn't need to gain any gold, because we can just gain market squares. So... Definitely something to be said. And maybe one more fortress. It does seem pretty important. Okay, and then we can get another broker, I guess. Trash the estate. We can get we can get coins or favors from this. Go with coins. And here we can do coins and buy to get a double ball. We don't top deck, but that's okay, we have desert guides. Oh, shrug. The faster you click that, the less I see. Thank you. So this looks okay. We can just 
gain a broker here. We have a turn. Our opponent still hasn't cracked the magic lamp, so they're very far behind. Um, I don't need to do that yet. All right, there we go. Okay, we could do it again. All right, fine. All right. And this one, I guess we could do buy. And top deck, so we can ball for fortress and broker. Uh, maybe we just buy a province anyway, just in case. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Okay, we really need another fortress there. Yeah, we shouldn't have top-decked two brokers. We should have top-decked one broker, but it worked out. We definitely misplayed there. Schemes. Yeah, schemes would be good. I mean, we have desert guides, so... It's all fine. Oh no, one fortress and two brokers works. We just trashed the broker. So we need to buy four balls to win the game. We can do that, of course. can do it via states also.
Cool. All right. Um, Well, that was extremely fast. We got pretty lucky with our 5-2 start and just some of our early shuffles. No doubt about that. Deliver. The only trashing is governor. Interesting. We can deliver a squire into our starting hand if we want. That gives us like a silver? Which is fine, I guess. It eventually gives us plus buy. Yeah, sure, whatever. Flagship is pretty likely the best thing we can do. Doing some transporting stuff, I mean, sure, we can do that. It's not all that exciting. So here we can have five. Seems pretty okay to me. It's definitely not great. Like, is it good to have the flagship missile shuffle? Probably. Do we want another silver? Man, I don't know. Probably not. I probably want a treasury. No joke. Then I want a tragic hero. I think... Uh, 
How do I feel about Necropolis? I think it might be decent. We eventually trash Hovel anyway. So if we just want to transport here, could trash... I mean, getting a Squire seems worthwhile to me. And what do we get here? A throne room? We could. It always seems like the kind of kingdom where a throne room could be good. Incredible. Three bias. We can deliver, transport, what? <laughs> That's the thing. We could do it with Tragic Hero. That's exciting. Um, but it might not work. It might not work. I'm going to give it a go. This tragic hero is going to become a king's cash or something. Maybe I should have bought a Squire. It's kind of bonkers that... No. Whoops. Hmm. Mistakes were made. Thanks for most definitely made. Yeah, but do we play this treasury?
Yeah, you know, sometimes you just gotta... You gotta let it roll. I do need another King's Cash. That much is clear. I think it's time to green. We've had our fun. Maybe not quite this turn, though. I guess we could draw with this governor. I don't know what we expect to gain from that. Not a whole lot, it turns out. Oh, shoot! Well, hopefully we find something. <clears throat> we found something. I mean, there wasn't much risk of not finding anything. But it is amusing. Okay, that's pretty good. I mean, if our opponent buys three provinces, we can totally get four, I'm pretty sure. I think our play is to take as many provinces as we can. I think is going to be a lot. We might only have the one governor, though. No, we have two. I'm pretty sure. And we have, like, three throne rooms, I think. Alrighty, let's see what we can do. Hmm. This is not looking not looking up for us. Can we empty piles? That's another possibility. I think we need to double play Conspirator to try to get some draw. Wow, that's it.
They're definitely at risk here. That was a bad turn. Governors are really good on the last turn. We probably want at least one tragic hero, though. Mm. Our opponent can look. Look at this freaking turn. Ah, oh, come on. I guess we lose. Guess we lose. Wow, man, this is our start too. That's pretty embarrassing. We just had that really bad turn. So I guess if we had bought a bunch of provinces, maybe we would have been able to... Oh my god, that was freaking throned. Our opponent literally draws deck, so how could they possibly not win? I think that might have been their last... Uh, governor? But whatever. Yeah. Yeah, I think they might just barely have enough. That was a joke, of course. Hmm. Hmm. That really didn't work out for me. I'd play it slightly different if I did it again. I guess. I don't know. I don't know what I needed to do differently. Hmm. Not sure what I needed to do differently. The end game was pretty obvious to me from the get go. I just don't know how to get there the most efficient way possible. I really thought that I was gonna. I mean, we had a really bad luck, right, on our penultimate turn there, or I guess what turned out to be our ultimate turn. We had a whole bunch of good cards. Well, I think we had, but maybe there was a shuffle we shouldn't have triggered. That seems likely. But there was some shuffle we shouldn't have triggered. That was a bunch of junk that we ended up drawing. A bunch of junk. Well, this doesn't look promising. So we have the 2 4. I'm probably going to open Broker. Yeah, that seems fine. Our opponent doesn't prefers research to broker because they're going to open Puka. Okay. Devil's Workshop is pretty good. So we can draw cards here, which I definitely like. Do we want to trash Curse Gold? Probably not yet. Hmm. 
Maybe not ever? Hmm. Drawing two cards. It's likely to give us three, but we might only get two. Alright. We have do we have plus buy? No. No plus buy. So there's a limit to how much we want to build here. Dang. There is museum. I don't know, man. Like, what else can we do here? Our opponent just keeps seeing this freaking puka. Yeah, I mean, we, lo we lost. It's pretty clear. Pretty clear we've lost. The throne room's not even good, though. I don't know why they played that. Oh, I guess it's optional to trash. This is kind of obscene luck that our opponent's having. And our luck is crap. So we need a throne room, for sure. Uh, what do we want here? Probably favors, just in case that ever matters. This is just so bonkers, how good our opponents draw. Like, I guess it's just, oh, I thought it was the best case scenario, but then their imp didn't find anything. Still really good to get Throne Scheme set up. What else am I supposed to do here? This is crap. Um... 
We already have a silver, right? I already have a scheme. Like, getting a second scheme would be good, but I feel like I'm kind of compelled to go after singletons at this stage. I wouldn't mind a second throne room, though. That seems probably worth it. Okay, I mean, we played our throne room. What do we even want on top? I don't even know what I want on top. Hold on, how do we get imps? We have no plus buy. We really needed to not cur trash that cursed gold, I think. Now we need a second Devil's Workshop. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I see that. It's just so bad. Should I leave the estate? Probably. No, that was a mistake. The king's cash, right? It's not a big mistake, but it just doesn't. I guess it's you can you can just king's cash gold, right? That's two two cards, and that always gives you province. Yeah, never mind. That seems fine. I should probably play for the same thing. So, what now? We do need a gold. I don't think we need to play that throne room. On the broker. I don't have all the time in the world to like. Gain more stuff. I'm gonna scheme double throne. It's got the most upside. I regret everything. Not really. We got stowaway.
Yeah, I don't have anything to say. We're behind. We're probably not going to get ahead unless our opponent has a dud, but how do they have a dud when they can scheme multiple things and set up stowaways? Yeah, uh, there was no way for us to win given what our opponent did. Um, so that's that. Game 5. Seems like it should have been winnable. Probably going to replay that. See, see if I can find a better line. I probably triggered a shuffle. I shouldn't have. And it needed to be more cognizant of that. It's just the way it goes sometimes. Thrown, thrown, scheme. Uh, imp, I guess. We have another imp, I think. So we don't actually need to play anything. So now we've top decked. All right, well, we can, like, get a research. That's points. Definitely don't need to. But, eh, whatever. It is what it is. We can get rid of the Devil's Workshop, like the second one at this point. Whenever we need to. Yeah, our opponent's just, like, expanding their lead now. There's just no way. No way. We're gonna hold off on gaining the estate. Because our opponent might not anticipate it. Oh, right, we only get to play the stowaway once now. Hmm. It is a problem. That is a problem. I just don't need any more imps, you know.
Getting another throne room could actually be dangerous, but whatever. Whatever. It was almost a dud. Somehow. But I can still get more unique points. It's killing me. So I can get a silver, yeah. Oh, and they can also pick up one point with a curse from Curse Gold at any time. I needed to not trash that. I mean, my my opening was just bad, basically. Not much I can do about that. Uh, okay. Well, that's not good. Uh, we can Puka, we don't need to. The bottom card is... Province, probably. Nope. So we need to get our research back. Oh. Uh-oh. We can't, like, even if our opponent does absolutely nothing this turn, we can't win. I don't know. I don't think there's any path forward for us. Apparently they can gain points with a copper. Well, that was a disappointing end. I really wish I could have won game five. It seemed very winnable. All right, well, got two more matches left. We're going to have to uh, get some wins on the board if we want to avoid demotion. Until then...